against a senior from Coon Rapids, Michael Burkhart, 9-0. Again, ranked in almost every single national publication. We've got a, a, a great match to close out this incredible tournament. Stole in black, Burkhardt in white. And Mac, we talked about this match a little earlier in the week. He was talking about how you uh, you can't remember Stoll ever not being a heavyweight. He's been a heavyweight for the last five, six years. You know, normally a guy kind of works his way up into that weight class, uh, like like Burkhardt has. Burkhardt, state champion last year, at 220, uh, is now up at heavyweight. But Stoll, you know, he's been a big guy since he was a little guy. And, uh, and so definitely knows how to wrestle like that. And, uh, and like you said, he's been extremely successful, nationally ranked, and uh, should be a great matchup here. Stay low, stay low, stay low! Good hip pressure out of Sam Stoll there on the edge of the mat. Action's gonna carry us out of bounds. And I think Mike is really gonna have a tough time battling with Sam upper body here. He's coming up a weight class. His 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 real threat is his athleticism, his ability to get in and, and, and stay low or take low shots. I think he's going to struggle if he continues to stay upper body with, with Stoll here. Now wrestling for fifth place in heavyweight for White Bear. Mike Jacobs is the team against Joe Schiller. And that match, Schiller of the team of Grace is a win by an injury deep ball. Short time here in the end of this first period. 0 0 score. Sam Stoll really using heavy hands and active hands to, uh, to make Burkhart work there towards the end of that period. He's not just going to let him stand around and go into the second period of 0-0 zero, zero man. Stoll leads 1-0 one with 1.34 to go. Looked like our assistant ref was maybe looking for a possible choke down there. Didn't see it. It was called a potentially dangerous. Stoll digging those underhooks in. And we got a stall warning now on Burkhart. That could play pivotal later in the match. Shot out of Burkhart. Stoll throws his legs back, uses those heavy hips, spins around for the uh, takedown. It's a 3 0 lead now. One minute to go in the second period.
Sam really controlling Michael here. Kind of what you would expect to see out of a typical heavyweight match. And there's a uh, second stall warning now on Burkhardt. It's a 4-0 match now. Short time, time's winding down in the second period. KMS looking to, or uh, sorry, uh, Cass and Manorville looking to finish their uh, with their fifth title this this year at the Christmas tournament. They've already had four champions. This would be the fifth one for Cass and Manorville. It's just, it's tough as a heavyweight, for any heavyweight to, to kind of take a long reaching double like that and expect to do anything with it. You know, the body's so big that's coming down on top of you and it's just, it's almost an impossible situation to score from that scenario unless you are in with your hips underneath you, you know, coming in with a long shot like that, just being stretched out. It's just asking for a takedown and being in the situation that Michael just got himself into. Stoll's going to elect to let him go. Six to one now, 118 to go in the second period. Our third period, I apologize. And he just, he's got to take better shots if he wants to finish that. He keeps kind of putting himself in a long extended position. And Stoll's just going to sprawl and, and, and take that go behind all day long. And Stoll just doing a good job. You know, he got the stall call early just by, you know, staying active with his hands and pushing and, and he got that call early and, and kind of forced Michael's hand on, on having to, to make something happen. And, uh, and credit, credit Stoll, he is a terrific heavyweight. He, is, uh, he has wrestled this for Burkhardt. Thirty seconds to go. Ten seconds to go. And that's the way it's gonna finish with Sam Stoll getting a major decision, nine to one. Great, great match there by Sam. Did everything right. Put the pressure on Burkhart, forced him into some bad shots, and, uh, and came out with a major decision. Great, great match by Sam. And that's gonna bring it to an end for the 2012 Minnesota Christmas Tournament down here in Rochester, Minnesota at the uh, Rochester Regional Training um, Center. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Mac Ryder and this is Gordon Beershank. Winner third place uh, 2012 Minnesota Christmas Tournament. Thank you. See ya.